As the local racing community mourns the death of driver John Pickert, the promoter of the event in which he died makes changes. Buses and RVs will not be allowed in upcoming Raysom or Reckham events. Pickert was driving an RV when he crashed. Fox 28 News reporter Jason Hackett joins us now with reaction from several people who knew him. Jason. Now, Tiffany and Scott, one thing I've learned throughout this is that the racing community is a very tight-knit, very passionate community. They tell me Pickert who they call JP, always had a smile on his face and loved being around the track. They say his death this weekend calls into question some of the practices, some of the safety practices at novelty races like the one that happened on Saturday. Everyone has something that really gets their motor running. And for some, that thing is a motor. David Ballstedt and Johnny Spa fit that mold. Spa owns his own racing shop. Do a lot of welding and fabricating and, you know, build roll cages. As for Ballstedt, by night he's tearing up the track at Hawkeye Downs and has done racer or Reckham events in the past. I've driven in the bus race. I've seen a bus roll right in front of me. Racing means the world to these guys, which is why Saturday's loss hurts. It's kind of numb, you know, you just feel so bad for everybody involved. Both men knew JP. He's raced it every year that I've been out there. And his love for the track. I guarantee he has a smile on his face when it happens. They also know the risks associated with novelty races like this one. For one, the track was running clockwise rather than the usual counterclockwise. If you're going to flip over, you're going to land on the driver's side. Then there's the safety measures inside some of the vehicles. Normal race cars, whether it's a, a drag car that goes straight or a circle track car or a road racing car, they all have some type of pretty safe roll cage in them. The older model motorhome JP was in Saturday didn't. I would definitely get rid of the motorhomes. They're not built to roll. I mean, they're built to ride down the road. Even if more safety measures are put into place, Spa admits there's always danger behind the wheel, no matter the event. Race them and wreck them type deals aren't as safe as normal racing, but normal racing is also very dangerous too. Now, I spoke on the phone with Arlo Becker. He's with BNB Promotions, who runs that event. He told me several things today. He says they're set to have another Raysom or Reckham event in Farley. That is set to go on. That won't be canceled. It will be de dedicated in the memory of JP. And as you said earlier, no RVs or school buses will be allowed in that event. We're covering the corridor tonight in Cedar Rapids. Jason Hackett, 